Hey guys, uh, today I am going to show how to uh, install MySQL in our Mac OS. Okay, so open your browser, just type MySQL, <coughs> then hit enter. Uh, you will get uh, mysql.com. Okay, so just click on this uh, website and you see here mysql download documentation and developer journal is there just click on downloads uh, then scroll down scroll, uh, and you see here mysql community downloads okay click on this one then you will get lot of uh, community downloads uh, first we can download the mysql community server okay click on this uh, mysql community server then it will show mysql community server 9.1 and uh, uh, it is the latest latest one innovation 9.0.1 innovation it is the latest version and it is uh, uh, automatically select our operating system so mac os and coming to here here we, we, uh, we can get lot of uh, options uh, first mac os 14 or uh, this is for uh, macbook air m1 m2 okay if you have any intel intel chip mac os 14 you can download okay i have the intel intel chip so i am downloading this one uh, uh, just uh, click on no thanks just start downloading okay it will start uh, downloading it will say uh, take some time because it is 520 something mb uh, after downloading uh, just uh, click on this folder it will take into a local folder uh, just double click on this one it will take some time okay here you see verifying my sql yeah you will get like this package okay okay just click on this uh, double again you can just double click on this one then you see this uh, this package will run program to determine if the software can be installed just give allow just uh, it will take some uh, it is loading yeah now it is just click on continue continue just give agree again installation time just click on install I give your uh, admin password like your uh, what is your uh, mac os uh, password just give that one just click on give and after that click on install software it will take some time uh, to install the software yeah after that uh, please enter a password for the root user okay just give password uh, whatever you want but uh, the reasonable password consists of a of at least eight characters that area mix of letters numbers and the other characters okay just you can give whatever the password you, you want okay uh, just i am giving a uh, password yeah uh, click on finish again it will ask your uh, admin password just give your uh, whatever the admin password you have just click on okay Is take some time to configuration yeah uh, it is uh, configuration is done the the installation was completed successfully okay uh, just close this one uh, do you want to move the mysql 9.1 installer to the trash yes just uh, click on move to trash and then you can go here just click on this system preference uh, you see here the mysql um, this logo click on this logo you see activate instance yeah, it is activated and click on this configuration you will get the base directory whatever the where uh, where exactly your mysql uh, uh, base directory base directory a path okay this is a path you can see the path here base directory path it is in user local mysql uh, data directory path user local mysql data okay uh, this configuration gives the path okay 
then just close this one let's open the terminal okay uh, i will maximize it and uh, i will zoom it here here uh, just type mysql version okay please follow me okay uh, if you not getting if you directly getting the version then there is no need to configure okay if you getting like this command not found uh, mysql then you should configure how to configure means uh, just follow me like first we you have to uh, command like ls um, hyphen al okay just hit enter just observe here uh, you in this uh, thing there will be a dot z s h r c file okay if it is there then inside this file we have to add the path of the mysql okay if it is not present then how to create i will show okay uh, before that i will clear the thing okay here just uh, write the command like touch p u c h touch dot z s h r c okay touch space dot z s h r c if you hit enter it will automatically create the dot z s h r c if it is not there if it is present already then no need to hit the command okay just remove these things because i have already next step is already we ha i have the dot z s h r c right so i have to open that file so command is open space dot z h z s h r c okay hit enter it will open one in uh, it will open one file in a text editable form okay just zoom it i will zoom it right yeah here you see i have to add the mysql path in this format okay same like this only i have to add okay so i will give the command like a add comment add the mysql path okay here i should i have to give the uh, command like export same i have to follow like this only okay uh, actually wait e, e x p o r t export path zoom it okay export path equals and then uh, you can give string inside that you have to give the uh, like path like this okay uh, let's go and uh, search the path path of uh, path okay uh, so uh, what should i do means i uh, go here just open this uh, uh, this spotlight uh, here uh, just type u s u s r sorry u s r okay it will give some suggestion uh, go to search in finder okay actually uh, here you see i have uh, i divided my os in two types so actually my everything whatever i downloaded i install it will be comes in this this one okay so i am searching usr here here you see my usr is here just open this one and open local and you see my sql is present here just open that one open the bin file then come here just right click just come here and just right click copy the bin as a path name copy this one then go to this text editor again here you should paste that one okay paste that one and here you see up to bin there will be a, again something like i have to add that thing, that that one also here okay uh, i <coughs> colon dollar path okay just save it come here file and save it and just close it this one okay just open the terminal again okay open the terminal now we configured the 
configure the thing. Now I have to activate whatever the uh, configuration we did in .zshrc, right? To activate the thing, we have the command called source source dot z s h r c hit enter okay we yeah it is activated because it is not um, providing any error so uh, next uh, you can check whether my version is uh, we added right that is working or not we can check okay that that configuration will work or not we can check so again uh, my sql uh, iPhone iPhone version okay just hit enter you see my SQL is added to our OA now it is clear okay let's check whether the uh, my SQL server is working or not okay server is working or not so first you have to give my SQL minus like minus not iPhone u <coughs> root iPhone P okay hit enter uh, it will it is asking the enter password uh, 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 root password uh, before uh, while installing time uh, you should give that one okay at two three yeah I given the uh, password uh, it is coming to MySQL okay MySQL is activated now okay now we can see uh, whether it is uh, working or not but uh, already it is perfectly working uh, so uh, let's see uh, show database basis hit enter sorry okay uh, spelling mistake yeah actually spelling mistake yeah uh, let's uh, check once again show database okay hit enter you see the databases uh, it is working fine uh, let's check let's create a, our own database and uh, then we can check okay Cre uh, for creating the database we have we have to give create database and give the name like a demo okay i'm giving database name as a demo hit enter okay let's check whether the database is uh, uh, it will uh, imp like trigger here or not okay let's check show databases you see our uh, database is created demo okay this is how uh, we can configure and uh, we can activate mysql in uh, mysql uh, mysql in os and uh, let's download the uh, mysql workbench okay just open your web browser and just uh, mysql queue mysql and open this mysql again go to downloads and come uh, down and just uh, um, click on mysql community gpl downloads in mysql community downloads just see the mysql workbench okay click on this one and uh, it is uh, automatically take the uh, operating system here you see arm for m1 and m2 chip and it is for intel x86 64 bit okay i am downloading this one it is a okay i click on download and just no thanks just start my download it is started downloading after downloading just open this one uh, just click on uh, show in folder and just double click on this one yeah it is just uh, uh, we have to drag and drop this one okay just drag this one to here uh, then uh, it will take copying the uh, some of the uh, mysql uh, uh, things mysql bench to applications okay. yeah it is copied just uh, close this one close this one and search yeah here you see mysql workbench double click on this one you to want to open it yes open yeah <coughs> uh, this is the local instance click on here and if you click on this one 
it will ask the password whatever the uh, root password you given right you can uh, just give that one yes continue don't show the message yeah continue anyway yeah you see uh, these are the things uh, uh, th this is how uh, uh, we have to install mysql workbench